Welcome back. Cutting with open profiles is something that's been improved in SOLIDWORKS 2015, and that's what I'm going to teach you about in this video. Let's start by creating a sketch on the front plane. I'm going to create a solid, and I'll bring in a rectangle first. I'll do a mid-plane extrusion, something like this. Just drag the handle and accept our work. All right, let's create one more sketch. I'll do it on this face. Right click, insert sketch. I'm going to create a three point arc here. Here's my first point, my second point, and my third point. Now, in order for the cut to work, the sketch has to intersect an edge of the solid, or it's got to be coincident to it. Otherwise, you're going to get an error message. Let's try it out. Let's activate the extruded cut command. We've got a new option under end condition. We have blind. Previous versions of SOLIDWORKS had the through all option. And here's our preview. I can flip the side to cut by checking this box, flip side to cut. And let's click OK to accept the cut. Now I'm going to change the sketch plane and see what happens. Let's right click on our sketch, select edit sketch plane. I'm going to use the top plane. Let's click Accept. Here's my error message. SOLIDWORKS tells us open profiles should be created using a face of the solid. Let's click Close to exit this error message. How can I solve this? Let's edit the feature. Instead of the blind end condition, I'm going to select Through All. Once again, check this box to flip the direction, flip side to cut. And let's click Accept. And here's our cut. This concludes our video about cutting with open profiles.